Hey besties, so what I'm actually doing today is a requested video on how to do Rice Krispie Treat wrappers. Now, a few things about this video. I am going to print it and assemble it with you guys. However, it is going to be on copy paper and not the glossy paper that it typically would be wrapped in. Another thing is, I'm going to show you when we assemble this two different ways to do the wrapping and also two different ways to uh, cut your label and one thing I do want you guys to know you don't have to do this in Cricut so I'm not actually gonna cut it with my Cricut you can do it in publisher Microsoft Word using the same exact template okay the same exact measurements and everything so I do have this template here that I made based off of the measurements from the Rice Krispie Treat that I unwrapped and so your design space is going to be 2 inches by 5.5 inches these 0.5 inch uh, spaces are going to be for your taper glue this is just the side of your Rice Krispie Treat I decided to only use one side which was going to be this one and then this back side would be uh, pretty much the whole back of my Rice Krispie. You don't have to do it that way that's just what I found was easiest when I went to assemble this. We'll go ahead and get this constructed here with you guys and then we can move on to assembling. So I'm going to start off this template with a square. I'm going to click my lock proportion. I'm going to make this 5.5 inches by 6.5 inches. Okay. I'm going to make this red. And then I will insert another square. The square that I'm going to enter is going to be for this long strip right here. This is not something that's necessary. I did it because uh, it was on one of the Rice Krispie Treats that I had initially done my measurements with but it's not on all of them because when I purchased the box of Rice Krispie Treats for this video it wasn't on all of them. Okay so I'm gonna make this strip a print and then a pattern and then I will make this checkered flag print and then since these pieces are hanging off the sides I am going to slice it and then remove those ends okay this image I got from Google and when I uploaded it to design space it basically removed the background which makes it um, a little difficult to see so what I'm gonna do is add a white circle here in the back it is gray right now just so that I can see what I'm doing okay and now I'm gonna select these together group it and then make the background white again okay and then I will add this little yellow circle right in over it Group them together and then add it in here over my wrapper. I'm going to add it in here over my Rice Krispie Treat logo and then flip it like this. I'm going to curve it, make it yellow. And then make it a tiny bit smaller. Okay, so that is the finished product of constructing that bag you want to attach and then also flatten. And then that will allow you to print. 
Um, so on here, I'm just gonna cut the top and the bottom, and then on the sides is where I'll use the design scissors. Now these scissors are from Michael. They came in a pack of 12. I got them for 60% uh, off when they had that sale. They're not that great. I'll say that. Don't rush out to buy them. Um, but if you're cutting one single page, you're good. Like if you fold up your Rice Krispie Treat wrapper and try and cut it, it's not going to happen. They were only $4 because that pack of 12 was $10. So not very expensive. Um, but they're just not extremely great. So it'll be like that. So I was trying to get that same look as the Rice Krispie Treats, how it has the um, little jagged edge. So that is how it came out and that is with the you know jagged edge on it this is a true story of making lemons into lemonade because i purchased a paper crimper for my chip bags and for um you know this type of thing which you don't really need it it still looks okay without it but i still wanted to try the uh, crimper so i ordered one from ebay and they sent me the wrong one it looks like a diamond shape and i was not very happy so they are resending another one out but after i decided to do this i decided to just go ahead and pay for this one and let them send me another one because I kind of like this one. It's like a diamond shaped and it looks like tire tracks up on there. So for these like boy themed ones, I, cause this one's a skateboard, it has wheels on it as well. I figured, huh, it'll look like, like tire tracks on there. So I'm gonna keep it. Instead of this one, looks like that with the little flap. 